morning you guys happy wednesday this is a really weird random way to start a vlog but this is my new heatless curls method let me show you here's the before it looks insane Today is September 2nd, 2020, and we are distance learning. Feel like taking you along with me on my random day today. All day. This is gonna be a day in the life of a distance learning teacher. Now, today is a little significant and special because it's me and my fiance's um, fourth year anniversary. We were supposed to get married in June, but we pushed it to May because of the unnamed thing. Just kidding, because of COVID. Yeah, he's working right now, so I am just so busy today. So I wanna take you with me because I need it because I was kind of getting into a rut. So we're gonna do some fun stuff right now. Um, I'm really trying to calm my body before going into this. I'm trying to calm my mind because I feel rushed right now, but it's fine. I'm not starting until eight o'clock. I have everything ready. We're just gonna do eye ready assessment today. But you know what, you guys? You're gonna see all the craziness that goes on today. I'm not even gonna tell you. You're just gonna watch. Good morning. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. I hope everyone can hear me. Greetings. <laughs> Typing the agenda real quick, you guys. And then you guys are just gonna copy it briefly. We are doing the same thing we have been doing. I ready testing. We're finishing it up today slash continuing on. So you guys can say hi to each other in the chat box. Say good morning to each other. And the attendance question of the day is, if you could travel anywhere, where would you travel? And be ready with an answer when I call your name. Okay, you guys, it's 9.15. We're taking a 15 minute recess and what I usually do is make a smoothie during this time for my breakfast. So I'm gonna do that and I might eat some cereal too. I have not been eating enough, I can tell. I've been hungry in the middle of the night. Um, yeah, so what the kids are doing right now is they are doing their eye ready assessments and that's all we're doing because I need that done this week and I don't want kids to rush and I don't want them to feel rushed. But let me just make a smoothie. Let me wake up a little bit. All right, you guys, it's my lunch right now. Long story short, um, my fiance works like two hours away every day. He works in construction, which is why we're planning on moving soon, in a year, less than a year, to go closer to his work. Anyways, he usually takes my 2007 Nissan Sentra to work. Um, however, we think it's about to blow up. Actually, we think the transmission's going out, so I'm going right now to take it to a mechanic. <sighs> Positive thoughts. Hi, you guys. Um, so I'm waiting for my brother to pick me up from the dealer. Not the dealer. <laughs> the 
mechanic and I am almost positive it's a transmission because on other Nissan Sentra 2007s, it has gone out. So I'm accepting the terms. I have to get a new car and it's like not a good time to get a new car, but you know, that's how life is. Uh, so now we have to make a choice on what we want to do. You know, this could be a total like blessing in disguise. One of my best like habits I have instilled in myself as of lately is carrying a book on me at all times. Um, I'm almost done with this book. This is, I think, my sixth book of the year. I have never read in my life, you guys. It is bad. I have never read for pleasure since elementary school. So I've been thinking, how am I supposed to teach reading and tell my kids to love reading if I don't love reading? So I decided I'm gonna read and I'm just gonna try to finish a book. Um, I'm gonna do an end of the year book haul of all the books I read. I'm trying to read 10 books this year, but this book, if you have read it, let me know. It's really, really good, you guys. Like, this is just my avenue of type of book I like to read right now. I'm just trying to not have so many racing thoughts in my head all the time. So this really just calmed me down. Um, and now I love reading. Like, I would rather read than look at my phone. It's really loud. I'll wait till my brother gets back. I would rather read than just sit and scroll on my phone, honestly. Like, I would rather just read a book. Okay, my brother's here. Greetings, everyone. Happy Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Um, aw, thanks. Thank you for saying hi. So you guys can just chat. We're gonna wait for everyone to come in. Same per usual. Oops, what am I doing? Whoa. Whoa there, tiger. Thank you. Go ahead and write that down. I'm gonna go make a coffee because your teacher needs one. Welcome to the party. <gasps> uh-huh. I know. I keep going. Keep it up. You're gonna win eventually. Especially with your growth mindset. Some money sometimes, there's some gift cards sometimes. It really just depends. All right, I'm gonna make a coffee real quick, you guys, and then I will be right back. So go ahead and write this agenda down and we will start shortly. Hey, you guys, I just got home. The kids are writing their agendas down. I'm making a energized drink. <laughs> I am very tired, but I am very hungry, but I can't eat until recess break. Okay, so I just use a LaCroix sparkling water. I like the hibiscus flavor. It's really, really good. And fill it up. Top it off. Um, here is the energy drink I use. It's Mio Energy. It has caffeine in it. So it's the perfect caffeinated beverage for the afternoon. Hey, you guys. Long time no talk. After I was done with class today, I talked to my BFF John for two hours, you guys. My teacher BFF John, he teaches third grade now in the same district as I do. And we have been friends since fifth grade. And maybe one day I'll tell the story of how we met. But until then, I went to go to Costco for my eye appointment because I'm getting contacts. I got contacts and I got another pair of glasses, another pair of blue light glasses. Um, and I'm happy with the price of it. And let me show you what I got at Costco. So I got this book for my nephew. It's his birthday yesterday. So we're gonna celebrate it for Labor Day. And he loves sea creatures. So I'm so happy I found this at Costco. I also got this book. I couldn't resist. Um, this is I Promise by LeBron James. I read it. It's really, really cute. And this is gonna be like a read aloud. I would love to do to really any grade, you guys. Like this is very cute. And I really admire LeBron James, like as a person. I don't really know about him basketball wise, honestly. As a person, I think he's pretty great. Um, I got some of this granola. It was on sale for five bucks. I love to drink this or eat it with almond milk, a big old thing of almond milk, some frozen fruit for my smoothies, and then garlic salt, which is a must, and a big old yay are these, because I think we're going to Arizona for Labor Day for at my um, parent-in-law house. Is that how it's called? Parent-in-laws? Whatever. Mom and dad, father-in-law, Jake's family. Um, I think I'm gonna bring these there 
Well, obviously that's why I bought them, but they're really good, you guys. I'm pleasantly surprised with these. All right, it's, I think, nine o'clock, and I'm about to give my brother a haircut outside. Um, I'll show you before and after <laughs> this terrible lighting. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, yes, I'm going to cut this short. I'm gonna trim this with some scissors. Sorry, because we like a nice hard part. Oh, sorry. Um, and uh, we like to sweep it over with gel, and it's a little too long on the top, I actually don't think so, but he does. All right, his hair is done. All right, let's see the side. Yep, looking good. Dang, I think nice. Do you like it? Yeah, I give the service a C plus. <laughs> Thank you, I'll accept cash. Okay, I just want to show you. Okay, so this week was eye ready testing. And I just wanna show you what I added. I'm just gonna do this quickly because I'm gonna change a few things for next week um, or the week following because some things aren't working but I am making a video just dedicated on that. So hold tight, put that seatbelt on. So basically this is the independent work and students usually for independent work, um, they go on extra math which is right here. It's linked for them, they just sign in. And I added this independent work folder because it was getting a little too much and I'm gonna change it again. So, um, and this is what I have been doing for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, but I'm gonna change it up because I need to integrate more science and social studies right now. So I'm thinking of how I'm gonna do that. And then we really just worked on our iReady and when kids were done, they could go on iReady games, they can go on Prodigy. And I made this fun folder and they could go on natgeokidsco.org or typing.com, like for fun. And just like that, you guys, my day's over. Good news on the car, kind of. I just got the phone call and it is good news. I'm not gonna downplay it, downplay it. It's good news. So it just needs some transmission fluid and um, something fixed with a belt or something. So, okay, cool. That's good. However, when I get a smog check in like four months, I may have to change something out of it, which is not good because it's gonna be over a thousand dollars. It's just our commuter car for now until we move. We're plant, so we live like on the very northern part of Los Angeles County, and we are moving in over the summer towards like Southern California more, like Temecula, if you know where that is, that's where we're gonna be moving to, that region, south of Riverside, north of San Diego. Um, that, those were our plans. So I just wanna make that car last until we move maybe, or like in the perfect world, until I pay off my student loans, which would be in four years. But anyways, I'm sure you guys don't care about this. But thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, yesterday was a really good day. I didn't even need to take a nap yesterday, and I usually do. I was just high on adre adrenaline, so right on. Uh, be sure to follow me. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I totally forgot. Since you stayed all the way to the end of this video, guess what? I'm doing a giveaway. Okie dokie. So this is the giveaway. I'm giving away this book, this distance learning book. This was like back ordered. Um, took a really long time to get to me, and I didn't use it actually and I have an extra one of these so this is what I'm giving away to anyone who wants it this is what you need to do you need to be sure to be subscribed to me and you need to go head on over to Instagram and follow me on Instagram so after you have followed me on Instagram I want you to come back on this YouTube video and comment your username and then I'm gonna draw in my next video, you will find out who won. So if you are interested in buying this or winning this book for distance learning, go ahead and enter the giveaway. I'll say it one more time. To enter, you need to be subscribed to my YouTube channel. You need to be following me on Instagram. My handle is right here. Then you need to comment in the comment section below your Instagram handle, and I will be choosing out of the comments the winner. I will be checking if you actually followed me on Instagram because that's part of the rules. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy your three day Labor Day weekend. I know I am. I'm going to the lake, I'm so excited. We're gonna see my, uh, my parent-in-laws in Arizona. So that's gonna be really fun. I hope everyone has a really great day and I will tell you, distance learning is getting easier. I'm admiring my kids more and more every day and it's, it's going 
way more smoothly. Um, I'll catch you guys later. Enter the giveaway.